game starts, we'll get into actually some commentary right now. Yeah, let's go. Bad you know in Z. Love to see it. The Ikes are actually putting in work today. We actually have Lamo who actually took a win off of Day. He isn't losing bracket now, but not after a hard fought victory against uh, Iolte. Yeah, Iolte, very great in the matchup as well. So, But now we have Fabino who's even better, I think. That's it. Like, definitely our tried and true, our number one right here, the Ike coming in clutch. Going against Z, this one has been a back and forth at times. Both these players have definitely traded sets in the past. This is a brand new venue. Of course, Z wants to show off. I'm sure he wants to take the big win with his first weekly at the venue, but not going to make it with plays like that. As Sharking with the up air, making it difficult for Diddy Kong to land. Yeah, I'm, I'm sending him this shit, so... <laughs> I'm so, doing double duty right yo, now. Yo, double duty? Shout out to Ducky Doom. Yeah. Streaming and trying to get commentary in there, too. It's well, doing bracket as well a bit. Oh, it's true. Triple duty. It'll yeah, pay you enough. I have to. I have to set up the the, the characters on this on Star GG. I have to make sure the, the set count is good on the screen. So yeah, like triple duty as well. So it's all covered the ball for the first match. Awesome. All right, but it's okay because he has his stride right now, just putting an absolute wall up Woo! on Babino and just barely gonna take that stock. Bring it at least back to even in terms of stocks right now. Only 50 percent behind. That's a Diddy Kong away though. Oh, for sure. And also, Ike is a very strong character, so like, it won't take too much to kill uh, Diddy Kong, especially on this side of the stage. That's where it gets tricky. Of course, Diddy Kong's game plan is to slow things down, get it, what he can from Banana, and eventually get the kill confirm off of that at high percentages. Ike, so explosive. Once he gets one opening, you can get jungle for what seems like years. Yeah. And right now, like, everything that Pepino is doing, like, is yeah, having trouble, like, punishing as well, so. That's it. Diddy Kong's there doing go. a good job of spacing. Only really getting close once he gets that banana in his corner. Sure, it's gonna help make the make every player shield when you have banana in hand. So like, it's very it's gonna be easy for Z. And the up reverse gonna do it. Love it. Seen that a lot it. out of Bambino. I love that little uh, confirm. Basically, people who are trying to recover low aren't quite as safe. Usually, that's what people do. Yep. They want to recover low to hug the stage, so they're very hard to punish. But Bambino can just rip that right away. The only counterplay that you can do is actually outspace. Yep. Oh, but he do it right back. And now it's dead even compared to the last stock where it was like 50%. But yeah, like all you have to do is like space it out and then just wait for the OB to like fit going up. Yeah. Like and Diddy Kong is a great character for that because he can charge his up beat. <laughs> that is true. Not a lot of characters have that luxury though. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Because <laughs> you're resident uh, Richter main here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> I feel the pain. <laughs> Keeping it even here in the last stock. We do see that throughout this game. He's been making a bit of a lead. He had a rough start at the beginning, but now that he's found his footing, that should make it very difficult for Bambino to get anything started until now as he evens it up in his percentage right now. Both players at 60%. And just not able to come in. Z obviously very prone. Ooh! Very prone to go for those monkey flips, and that was one too many from Bambino. Yep. Able to scoop him up into a finishing off with an up air off the top. For sure. And yeah, like you said, we all... Know, like. Pretty much everybody knows that Z likes to do these monkey flip very high up in the sky. So Not like, save try, to, try to reset neutral or just get center stage. Correct. In this case, was like to get to the other corner. Usually does that off stage as well. Yeah, definitely picked up on as well in our own sets. But uh, I'm sure it works basically in the early goings of bracket when you're facing, uh, you know, yeah. players but early on in the bracket. Bambino, not going to let that slide. Yeah, and there we go. He's a big fan of Zazaku Castle, even he doesn't play a, a fighting game character in this. But whenever he has that FD open, he'll take the Diddy Kong there. Not enough people do that, actually, I find. Everyone usually just defaults to the basic old FD, but technically you can choose over yeah. 80 FDs. And Pretty I'm much. guilty of it myself, I'm sure. Yeah, uh, we, we're all kind of guilty of it. Sorry. And, but, like, there's also, like, certain stages are, like, technically, like, not allowed. Because yeah. are like 2D stage. Yeah, that's fair. And not 3D. That's true, because some things work on the uh, other axes. Which makes Cloud a worse character. <laughs> I know yeah. we kind of skimmed over it, but there was a beautiful combo there that Ike did using his arrows and then followed up with a banana in the air to continue his onslaught. <laughs> yeah, something eventually he's going to uh, give. You have a couple hits on shields. Soon you want to get break out. It. You want to get out. Oh, wow. Good job. It's not a big punish, but it's still a punish to the spot dodge. Oh, it's okay. You get one or two hits from Ike, and it feels like it still hits like a truck. Yeah. Oh, Raz might uh, be the bravery of this man. He is getting reward rewarded from it. I don't think it's bravery. I think it's slug. You know, <laughs> there's a fine line between courage and stupidity. Like. <laughs> yeah. Here we go now. Z finding his footing and racking up the person, the person back. 
hold a tree. Z finally losing his first stock, but uh, what's some extra credit right here? 100% onto Ike himself. Yeah, and it's going to be make it very helpful to uh, and keep I his lead as much as possible. I'd love to see that Bambino's mixing up with the banana. Obviously, he's faced Z quite a few times, so he's got to learn his tricks with banana himself. That's something I think more people should do. A lot of people kind of use Diddy Kong's banana throw. Like, he'll just throw it out with no reason. If you're in place of it, you can catch it in the air as he's throwing it. Yep. And you also can catch it with, like, what we call Z, with the Z button, the Z catching, which will make it that you don't do any animation, no fair, no nair, yep. whatever. So it's literally a lagless catch. We don't Which use is enough. very helpful. Especially since there's a lot of prominent characters that use items like that, like Diddy Kong and uh, Rob, Rob, who are both top tier. We need to learn more of that stuff. We're being too lazy. Yep. And as you said right there, making it very ambiguous for his recovery, even though he still decides to go against the, the wall. He's gonna monkey flip on stage. But he waited just a bit, huh? I said he's gonna monkey flip on stage, and then but he did. <laughs> is that coach? Oh! Jesus. That move is a little ridiculously strong. I've seen it. If it killed like that with rage, I'd be like, yeah, I understand. But yeah. I was at a cool zero percent. But that's the thing. He ran into it as well, so it's like. Yeah. Oh, you love to see it. Yep. Does not able to get the tech. He comes back from it. I'm surprised. Diddy Kong is a very strong strike. Spike. Surprising for that little chimp. I don't think it's as strong as we we think it is, but it's definitely a one with okay, yeah, super strong. But he has this jump, so he was fine. Yep. Good wherewithal from Bambino to come back from that. And it's a character's ability to even do so. He does have a very vertical recovery, so fair enough. In that situation, help him a lot. Yeah, like, Ike has to keep this jump as low as much as possible, because otherwise, like, his recovery is pretty questionable. Has to go for the up smash. I think in that situation, he would have rather the forward smash to guarantee, but he was too far from the blast zone. Set up the up smash and barely going to take it off. And we are tied 1-1 apiece right now. Obviously, that's the tried and true stage to go to as Diddy Kong. Uh, if you let Diddy Kong have FD, you better believe that's where you're going. Uh, that is off the table, though, now, I imagine. I think it's more of a Z thing yeah. than... Because... And I will need to, like, to know about Tweak, unless, like, all the players just ban FD against him. Yeah, I feel like... I, I feel like that'd be the first stage that I would ban against Z, but he seems to get away with it a lot. Uh, I feel... I mean, at the end of the day, uh, like, Diddy Kong is strong on, like, many, many stages, mm -hmm. and so you might not be able to cover every ban you want with... That is fair. Take it to two. I like the stage a lot, actually, for Ike. Small yeah. stage with a platform to extend the air combos. I like it a lot. Gives yeah. less space for Diddy Kong to run around, too. It's still it's still a, 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 like an average stage. Yeah. It's the as, the same as Battlefield and uh, as such. So it's definitely like an average stage. It's pretty much small Battlefield. Yeah. But a two platform are the same. Yeah, just that's pretty much it. They just glued them together. Yep. Yeah. That, yeah, that's what they did. <laughs> Sakurai was like, yeah, t put the two platform there, put some glue, and then th there we go. <laughs> we're done with the stage. Put a, a beautiful background, and then we're done. <laughs> Down air into jab, but one of those like, custom combos that only works on a stage like oh! this. This is what I'm saying. He's using the banana to his advantage when you face a, car a player that much times as Babino has faced Z. You've yeah. got to learn some tricks with the banana. For sure. And it's not just Z. It's like Diddy Kong is pretty much a, a, yeah. or like a very meta character right now. 100%. So you, you need to learn the matchup. And banana is a powerful tool. If you can use it against him, even to make him think, like, should I use the banana against him, is enough to make the sway the match in your favor. Oh, for sure. But Z, Z always has a banana in his hand. Oh, I love the idea. I just barely didn't connect with the down air. Going for the angel drop. Uh, Z's not so great with the turnaround back air, to be fair, but he still makes it work. Yeah. You know, it's Z. Still cleans he's, it up right there. He's not the most technical player in the in the PR, but he's, he makes everything worse. Well, that's what was, uh, that's what people have been saying is that Z's neutral is almost second to none, and then you but his punish game is like you know hit and run kind of thing. Yeah. Now imagine if he had the punish game of, as another fellow uh, Diddy Kong player in uh, the Monkey Man. Uh, Dario. Yeah. He has an amazing punish game. If you somehow combine those two together, I would have no issue believing that he could be like the first PR. <laughs> oh, for sure. Same. Although he has been including his game. We did see the, uh, the banana down air. He's been doing that a lot. He's been trying to implement aerial banana into his uh, repertoire. Yeah, so he definitely sure. is trying. It's just, uh, he has a simple combo that works. Yeah. That are consistent, easy to do. But he doesn't have like these cool like jab blocks set up and banana slips and mm -hmm. shit like that. Honestly, as we're seeing more and more of the game, I feel like consistency is definitely the name of the game. 
we do see the shock setups with uh, if you're everything goes right, but to be able to do it day in and day out, win these tournaments, because what you're doing is working, then you gotta stick to it. Unfortunately, <laughs> that's been working since day one. <laughs> day Mayor one. into up air. <laughs> yeah, that that was about to say like this 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 character that says consistency. Yeah. It is trickier now. Back in the day, like Nair up air was a super, super free combo that killed way too early. Oh, for sure. Now it's just the front one doesn't quite hit, but the back one is still the same as it's always been. So still good on the middle with the spacing to hit that back air, uh, uh, the back side of the Nair only to follow up with that up air. Uh, and now Babino's going to be running away with this lead. Let's see how he's going to be able to like bait him to get a banana because that. You know what? Uh, there we go. Oh, the kid. Like, I'm surprised, actually, even with the platform assist. Oh, I thought he was going to get it there, but he didn't get the trip. He actually uh, jumped, like, last second. And if you're in your air, you don't get tripped. You just kind of get uh, a little bit of hit stun. Oh, my God. We Sometimes for us, away you go. <laughs> we love Diddy Kong. <laughs> up smash not working. It's one of those Z things where it's like, up smash once, didn't work, up smash again. <laughs> yeah. And it works. You, just, you can't, you can't fall if it doesn't work. I think it's real people don't expect you to go for the same option twice. For sure. But uh, that's why it's a good option. I mean, when it's unexpected, it's the best. Correct. I've been saying, if it's a bad option, but it works, it was a good option. Yep. Might not work all the time, but it's fine. There's never a bad option in this game. Correct. There's just wrong guesses, and um, yeah, that's pretty yeah. much it. <laughs> like, no one would argue in rock, paper, scissors, if you lose with rock against paper, no one's going to say, oh man, rock's a bad option. No, no, they're just different options. And it's how you use them and when you use them that makes a difference. Yep. And he's going to scoop up with the up air. Doesn't oh. quite get out, but still follow it up. Not going to kill, actually. I'm surprised. F tilt is very formidable. Uh, is it going to be this, his chance to like make this game? Yeah, he has one chance. And this is like the Bambino special, or just the Ike special in general, where I see them just going for a dash attack and the most unsafest move. But if it hits, it's like a truck. Oh, yeah. It's, it's scary. Oh, we had it. That's what it, it has to set up for the throw anyways. It still puts Ike off his balance and gets a banana, which he uh, immediately throws away. We don't need potassium. Uh, yeah. It's, oh, my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> and it still works. Stuck on the platform. Going to scoop him up. Just barely taking that game. Again, both of these games right now looking like it's anyone's game. For sure. We might see another game five, which no, it's game four. not uncommon for these two. We might see another game five, though, if Bambino. Okay. I can't commentate that, but I'll try. I sh no. <laughs> I'm going to look like an idiot. Chat's going to hate me. I can try. They're going to be like, oh, he went for a projectile. And they'll be like, that's actually called a Hadouken. And I'm like, oh, sorry. I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't know. Well, I mean, I didn't know that, but example. I love Street Fighter, though. Trust uh, me. Yeah, we, we love trying to Street Fighter. Played it recently. I like Luke. Luke is fun character. The whole game looks really fun. So if you guys like that, you'll get some uh, really soon, actually, after this set. And uh, Z making sure that that Street Fighter comes sooner than later. <laughs> yeah. Starting off strong with a 68% combo. Uh -huh. Surprisingly, taking it back to the same stage. I mean, this was his counterpick initially, but it didn't seem to work out too much I in mean, the last game. It's pretty, it's pretty, it's pretty much new. even. He just had, like, a, a bad oh. comeback. Oh, Ooh. man, my man heard you. He was like, he doesn't have any jab lock setups, and he's like, I got, I got you, don't worry. <laughs> I got you, Dickie. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> didn't quite pan out, but it's, it's, it's working on it. <laughs> I guess down smash might have been the option to go for there. I think F smash might be a little bit too slow. Up smash might not pick up a grounded opponent. <laughs> but now, yeah, that's... Might be knowing the worst position against you. High percent, like banana, up smash confirm is easy. Even oh, yeah. down tilt. So this is definitely in the court of Bambino to make something happen right now. Yeah. And we did say that best of, this whole entire tournament is actually going to be best of five. Still running very smoothly regardless, despite the long games, but it gives players an opportunity to play more, and that actually plays a lot in Z's favor, and I keep saying this, but Z is so good at adapting that if you give him that long set, he just gets better with each game. Oh, for sure. Like we, like we said, like his neutral is 0 to none. Is that what he says? Yeah, 0, zero to none. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, that wasn't too sure. So, English expression, sir. Yeah. And so, like... You give him the long game, he's gonna have that for sure. Mm -hmm. that's, that's what he's best at. Can't bam up him yet. He's actually have the ledge and he seems to make some work with the banana as well. And I agree the banana is probably definitely scarier than Diddy Kong with banana. Oh for sure. Like he already hits hard. When you use a banana to to confirm any any move. A scary situation there, so the dash attack doesn't quite take it out, but uh, 
the percentage has swayed right now. Yep. Ike with a bit of a lead, and I love the fact that he's holding the banana as he's jumping up. And he's kind of making Z guess, like, is he throwing the banana or is he throwing it up there? And he's kind of just uh, keeping him juggle for a long time there. And now, <laughs> platform camping the banana because he doesn't want to get it. <laughs> oh my god. And it's even again. It's back right. Again, living through. Ike does hit hard, but he's getting uh, a little bit screwed over by the stage. He's getting at, like, a high direction. He's not anywhere close to the blast zone when he gets those hits. Yeah, especially because he's on the other side of the stage. Yeah. But Z, very close to that blast zone. Yep. And with a bit of rage, couldn't hurt. Oh Bamboo just needs one good swing, one half tilt, one fair, anything at the ledge. But Z doing a great job of sticking to the middle stage. Yep. But doesn't matter, goes oh. vertically, uh, nothing's yeah. going to save you there. The back air, yep, he did. I don't know if he tried a back air to like get him to, uh, to go center stage, but mm -hmm. yeah. He missed it. He didn't miss it. Uh, it's dead even, pretty much. Sticky situation with the banana at ledge. Goes for the da get up attack is good. It does have invincibility. He did get the hit, but he will still trip on the banana regardless. But since he was able to hit Diddy Kong, he was not able to get punished by it. Oh, they're playing catch right now. Again, so Diddy Kong's got to readjust. Yep. Especially like once uh, Diddy Kong throw the banana on your shield, it mm -hmm. bounce always the same in front of you, so you can jump forward and then oh, air or. Oh, that's tragic, actually. Just happened to waddle off stage, able to make it back, but uh, no, and able to get recover as well. Not going to get a punish for that. That could have been disastrous, of course. Yeah. I think they actually buffed that a like, bit. Yeah. Like, pre-patch, he would made it. He will, he would have made it back, but now he made it. So. Yeah, they make it the charge a little faster, because you also sink sometimes while you're using it, too, so. Yep. Oh, my God. And now that's where that's where it's he's, like, he's going to be even more defensive. He's... Like, he wants to get his percentage. Oh, no, I'm sorry. It's yeah. the other way around. I'm stupid. Yeah. Well, he I'm had no, stupid. He had no reason to rush that. He had to cherry pick his moment right there. Takes a 3-1 victory over Bambino. Like I said, this has gone back and forth. Bambino definitely had a chance to win that. And in some games, it looked like it definitely would, but here we are. Yep. And I'm stupid. <laughs> you know what? I'll commentate one Street Fighter match and look like an idiot. The game is very fun. So if you guys will put up with me, we'll do it. <laughs> 